These Valley nurses put everything on the line to care for their patients. Now they're doing the same for their jobs. Around 75 Mountain View Union nurses and supporters stood outside the hospital to protest potential layoffs and or pay cuts coming to HCA hospitals like theirs. This is not the time to withdraw support. This is the time to use every means necessary to back your healthcare team to take care of your patients. Mountain View Hospital is asking its nurses to forego their yearly pay increase, saying hospitals across the country are asking the same. A lack of patients has cost the hospital money, and there's too many staff on the payroll to care for them. When the nurses are laid off and there are no nurses to take care of patients, Patients suffer, patients will die. Mountain View Hospital utilized a pandemic pay program. It keeps paychecks coming to nurses who are sent home due to a lack of patient volume. The hospital offered to extend the benefit through June 27th, but union nurses say they'd rather have their pay increase. They change their mind on what the rules are to the program every single day. Uh, they give it to who they want and who they don't want. Oh, I'm sorry, you don't qualify. Uh, so in our eyes, that program, go ahead, take it away. In response, the hospital will cut off the pandemic pay program to union nurses on June 6th. Mountain View Hospital released this statement in part. At a time when hospitals across the country are struggling to survive and many are resorting to furloughs and layoffs, it is surprising and frankly disappointing that the National Nurses United would demand pay raises for their members and recently reject the continuation of a generous pay program that is providing continued paychecks for many of our colleagues. We are maintaining our focus on keeping as many of our colleagues employed as we can, despite significantly lower volume. The nurses refuse to take their demand. We refuse to allow them to uh, not follow through with what they promised. Cassie Mulnerick, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.